come as an individual and meet you there. Well, I'm glad you said that. I want to key in on something. I want to change the word of that song, Ashton. Yep, because it's going to go in exactly what, what Brother David just said. And I'm going to read the scripture to you. I'm not, I'm not changing anything, but I want us to sing scripture. Because for so long, we've heard on earth. That's not what it says. It says in earth. He said God wanted to do something personally. And when I tell you it, let me, let me read it. Can I read it? In Matthew 6, I'll start in verse 9. After this matter, therefore pray you, our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Where's the kingdom coming? I'm fixing to tell you where the kingdom's coming. Thy will be done yes. in earth. Can I tell you, you're made out of the dust of the ground. He formed Adam out of the dust of the ground and breathed the breath of life into him. In earth. What does that mean? In an earthly vessel. He yes. said the kingdom of God is within you. And that's what you're going to get. That's why what Brother David said is real personal for us right now. Why? Because it's in earth. And that's what God's wanting to do. He's wanting to bring and activate the kingdom of God in you and me. It's the scripture. It's the word. So when we sing this song this time, instead of on earth, we're going to say in earth, God. I want you, my God, I want you to understand just one word. The difference in what that means. Significantly different. On earth could be anywhere. But in earth is right here this morning. Right now. God, right now, in this body right now, activate the kingdom of God. That's what this means. And when you activate the kingdom of God, you want to talk about the miraculous. Can I tell you, nobody's sick in heaven this morning. Nobody's struggling in heaven this morning. Nobody's depressed in heaven this morning. There's no addiction in heaven this morning. There's nothing but life. And you know what they're doing? Before the very throne of God, they're worshiping, telling him how holy he is. So I'm telling you right now, I speak to everything in here that is not of heaven. Anything in your Come on right now. now. I'm telling you, it's what's in heaven right now that's going to be activated in your life this morning if you can believe that. you got to believe what you're saying. And when you stand up before the Lord this morning, and you say, yes, Lord, in earth, as it is in heaven, I'm telling you, something will begin to shift into your life. Something will begin to happen when you can understand and grasp. As it is in heaven, he said, it's not my will for you to be sick. It's not my will for you to struggle. But I'll tell you, you've got to be able to get activated in the kingdom of what's happening in heaven and allow it to happen in your life. And can I tell you something else? You want the authority, and you want to be able to walk in the kingdom. You got to shut everything down in your life. You got to shut it all down. Unplug the phone. You got to say, God, what is it? What is it, Lord? What are you saying? Because can I tell you, when you get a word from the Lord, you walk in divine authority and access of the kingdom. Without that, we're just walking around in flesh every day. There's nothing ever going to change. But if I can get a word from heaven, and I can allow the kingdom to be activated as he said in his word, I'll be able to walk in full authority and power. Yes. Yes. Amen. So when they sing it this morning, I want you to believe it. I want you to say in our floor this morning. Father Lord, I release it this morning. I release the kingdom of 
of heaven, Lord, in this house this morning. I release it over your people right now. Lord, let the kingdom of God be activated in every soul in this room right now. Every sickness I imagine to go in the name of Jesus. Everything that you're struggling with, I rebuke it in the name of the Lord right now. You will walk in divine health. No more struggles. No more struggles. I'm telling you, activate the kingdom this morning in your life. You walk in it. I wish I could articulate it the way that I'm seeing it this morning. I tell you that there, there, there's something about walking in the kingdom. When you understand who you are. That means everything. The Lord said, occupy until I come. What are we occupying? The kingdom right here. He said, occupy this land. I'm going to my father. But I'll tell you what, you're not going to have to do it alone. I'm going to send the comforter down with you to empower you to be able to walk in the statutes that I did. Occupy the land until I come. How do we occupy it? In earth as it is in heaven. He's given us a blueprint. And I'm telling you right now, they will nothing be able to come against you. Nothing that will be able to come against you to separate you from the love of God. Amen. There will be nothing that will be able to pluck you out of his hand. The Bible says how? Let the kingdom of God be activated this morning. In Jesus' name. I want to read.